Eleven lessons to never forget in life. I'm inspired by the difficult challenge that I'm facing right now. And I'm reminded of these lessons. Number one, always remember that you can grow without destroying others. You don't need to destroy others for you to grow. Number two, always remember that your dreams can be fulfilled without sabotaging other people's dreams. It's possible. Number three, always remember that nobody must go down for you to rise. We can all rise. We can all, in fact, hold each other's hand as we rise. Number four, always remember that nobody must be shamed or embarrassed for you to smile, for you to be happy, for your smile to be sustained. It doesn't have to be that somebody else must be shamed and embarrassed. If that's how you keep your smile, you are an evil person. Always remember that while others are rising, you can also rise. Because they can equally extend a hand to you for you to rise. We can all rise. Always remember that finding satisfaction in the pain of others will never bring you true happiness. It takes so much energy for you to try to take other people's joy and happiness, but you are not happy. Always remember that what you wish others is a prayer for yourself. What you are wishing others is a prayer for yourself. So when it starts happening to you, know that it is what you've been wishing for others and it is happening to you. Become the good fire that genuinely lights up others. Let us be the salt of the earth as God has created us to be. Let's not be the one that ruins the joy, other people's goodwill and other people's expectations. Never take delight in causing pain or sponsoring the tears of another person. Never be happy that it doesn't matter what the other person has done to you. But never, never take delight in causing another person pain. Even if it's in self-defense. Never take delight in that. Ten, never use your position of authority to punish others. And we see this happening everywhere. You never know what tomorrow has for you. Life is uncertain with no guarantees. Never use the position you occupy today to frustrate another person. For you can never tell what the future holds tomorrow for you, for your children. Allow the truth of God as a principle that will guide your days. Strengthen your relationship and set your course align your footsteps with God's purpose and you will see you will see that you will be guided by his hand never ever 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 look down on anybody except if you are admiring their shoes or you are admiring their beautiful manicured toes or you are admiring their beautiful set apart toes on their feet never ever look down on anybody this my dear, is a path to true peace. This is the path to lasting influence and a meaningful living that is a true principle of Ubuntu. I hope this inspires you as it is inspiring me. Things are not okay. Things are not okay in my soul with me. But I'm blessed. I truly believe that you are blessed. Take care of the people that you meet on your way up because there will be the same people who will meet you on your way down and they might be able to take you back on your way up. Have a blessed day. Be blessed.